Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll show you how you can create a AI art video through Mid Journey. Yes, you heard it right, through Mid Journey. Check this out. Yes, what I did was, this was the prompt. I have made this series few days ago. This series idea I got from HP Lovecraft stories. This was the set of images that it generated. And what I thought was upscaling the same image multiple times. When I upscaled the same image multiple times, I saw there is a slight difference in each and every output. From that, I got an idea of creating an animation from that same sequence of images. So I made a calculation for making a like a three second video. I need to have at least 12 frames per second so it's around 36 frames and I'll be looping it. I started upscaling this same image 40 to 45 times and same thing I did with this image also. Here you can see I kept on upscaling this same image. After upscaling like 40-45 times I came to the mid journey home page and I downloaded the entire thing. There's a small tip, you can select each and every image in this way or if you click in one image and keep dragging over the images then those images will get selected and I downloaded it as zip file download all the next step is compositing this entire image sequence in After Effects or in Premiere after unzipping I got all the files in a particular folder now to create the video sequence from these images we need to rename all the files in a ascending order or a descending order 0001 to it's 0041 now let's dive into premiere in the project panel double click and select the folder click the first image which is named as 0001 and then click this image sequence and import then drag that into your timeline but this is too fast to slow it down right click and go to speed and duration reduce the duration to 40 percent you can use optical flow so it will like morph let me show you if i activate the optical flow this preview won't show you the exact result so you need to like in out entire timeline and then go to sequence render in and out <laughs> this is crazy if you are trying to achieve this fluid type of effect then you can use this optical flow let's try with the frame blending render in and out with the frame blending option you can achieve this type of result so i have selected frame blending option i have just duplicated the track because i will be looping it twice so guys in this way you can do your experiment and showcase your creative ideas in my discord channel i would love to see them and in the end of this video i will be sharing the entire series of this hp lovecraft please do watch and let me know your views down in the comment below and please don't forget to like and subscribe 